This is Suman, your physics educator, and here we are going to solve question number three. I'll read the question for you. If a thunder is heard, if a thunder is heard by a man four seconds after the lightning is seen, how far is the lightning from the man? And uh, speed of the sound in air, as we know, that is equals to 330 meter per second. So he's saying that a thunder, that means after a thunder storm, or the, the, the lightning has uh, been seen, it uh, takes some four seconds of time to hear that sound. So how far, and what is the distance? Of that lightning from the man. What is the distance? We are calculating how far the lightning has to place. So the data he has given will write here the time taken by the sound to reach the man is four seconds. He has mentioned that it is four seconds. We are writing the data first. And speed already he has given speed of the sound in air is 330 meter per second. Here speed can be represented with V. And we know the formula. We have to calculate what is distance. How long is the lightning taking place? How long is the distinct, uh, distance of lightning from man? That is what we want to calculate. So distance, we have distance is equals to Speed into time. Speed into time. So that is speed is 330 and time is 4 seconds. So that will be uh, 2, 4, 3 is 12 and 30 meters. Okay. So the SI unit of distance in physics is always meters. Others you can calculate in, you can convert that to kilometers also. As we know that 1 kilometer is equal to 1000 meters, so 1320 meters by 1000 meters will give you, uh, so this will be 1.32 kilometers. So the lightning has took place some 1.32 kilometers away from the man. So that is why it is taking a time of 4 seconds. Hope this answered your question. Thank you.